Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> Today, we shall discuss, although the tropical season is not yet here, I want to share with you all some outstanding, outstanding layering combinations for Bath and Body Works, Bahamas Passion Fruit, and Banana Flower. I'm not limited to the season, so let's chat. So I got to thinking that with all these products that you get in all these different varieties of scents, I'm talking strictly Bath and Body Works, not the others, Victoria, don't tell nobody, secret, that it's worthwhile to discuss what you could layer with it. And I'm going to give you some affordable options you could layer it with and some I don't want to say unaffordable, but it's up there in price. Something that would create, something that would fit every single budget. So, while you see the lotion that's going on here, I am going to go ahead and, because the scent is the same across all of the product formulations. Here's a body lotion you have to apply the traditional way. Here is the lightweight spray body moisturizer. I'm gonna demonstrate how that works in a little bit. Made me think of something. That's okay. <laughs> so, we're gonna look at the notes and we're gonna follow the same exact principle of layering according to individual notes. Now, I'm just gonna read it to you because I don't have the screen up for you guys to see. Passion fruit, pineapple leaves, banana flower main three notes all right so what you could take and do and i'm throwing a few ideas out here using the noting the note layering principle you could just go ahead and take and take a passion fruit type of scent where passion fruit is either the strongest note and i believe bath and body works has scents like that where you could just take and layer something that is solely just passion fruit based. So I don't think this is the only scent that is passion fruit based. So take something with, with the strongest passion fruit note in the Bath and Body Works arena. Now, with that being said, there are there may or may not be a passion fruit, just solely passion fruit decked out. Bodycology, check cow gun, check even Victoria don't tell nobody secret and build off of that now our next note here is pineapple leaves i'll tell you right now that might be a good laying combination for it and i almost no i'm not going to tell that <laughs> tree huts pineapple the scrub and i think they have a matching body cream um if you don't want to go for tree hut you're more concerned about the ingredients that's absolutely fine. I'm watching Tree Hut kind of transform. They're becoming transformative with the type of ingredients that are in those things that they make for body care. So they're changing a little bit too. If you don't want to go to Tree Hut pineapple route to layer with this, because this is one of the notes that's in it. Beloved. Beloved is a Target exclusive. They have a pineapple, like a whole spread. I love when companies do that for body care. Like, only other company I know that does that all the way is Bodycology. When they release a scent, they're not just, oh, we're just going to give you a lotion and a spray. Like so. No. They give you the whole spray. They give you the body cream. They give you the whipped body scrub or the regular body scrub. Sometimes they give you both. They give you the shower gel that a lot of times is three in one. I see you, Bodycology. I see you. Putting the whole game on lock. Clink, clink. Do you hear me? <laughs> And then, um, beloved, the Target exclusive has a whole pineapple line, including the fragrance mist. So there's a lot of pineapple based stuff. I'll tell you another one. I never got a chance to tell y'all about Olay. Go down the aisle. If only if you're interested, you love pineapple scents, and only if you gravitate towards pineapple scents. Olay's pineapple. It's either pineapple and coconut water. I, I spoke about it. A um, few short months ago, last year, maybe a handful of times. That's a good body wash to start off with. And then you could finish it off with something that's like either this matching body spray for it or either the body lotion or go for Beloved's Collection or Tree Hut. 
Now, the only thing, tree hood, I can't give you everything, but let me let you in on a secret. Tree hut. Come, you might as well come on with the fragrance mist. That's all I'm going to say to you. That's all. Yeah. Anywho, back to our regularly scheduled program. That's all that I could think of for pineapple. The Tree Hut line of pineapple, the beloved line of pineapple that's a Target exclusive because you can't find it anywhere else. I get, I, I'm picking up what they're doing when they make these things exclusive to a store. Last time I had to call several other places for a particular Caress body wash that now is in all stores. The cocoa butter and oat milk. I was expecting it to smell like chocolate. Anywho, I'll put it on the community tab by the time this one go up. So, and then we got Olay, their body wash. Uh, that's pineapple and coconut water. It sounds so tropical, like you going to Jamaica or you just going somewhere tropical that's really nice. Maybe not Jamaica. Okay. And then banana flower. Now, banana flower. When I think of banana flower, I'm thinking on when I used to be plant-based in my eating. <laughs> banana flower. So it's it's not only edible. But then it's also a part of fragrance body care. One day I would like to smell the purest, purified and, and perfumed, very concentrated fragrance, perfume oil of just banana flower. Cause I'm curious, I'm curious about that. Now for banana flower, since I don't have a recollection of smelling it ever by itself, not combined with these other notes, pineapple and passion fruit banana flower my guess is this banana flower probably has a hint of banana and how it smells now i'm practically giving myself homework after this and that's okay that's all right it's gonna be fun <laughs> and so i'm putting it in my mind being imaginative here it smells like banana it's a flower okay now what do we know that smells like banana? When I say we, I'm talking about us, my brave family. <sighs> Tree Hut, I had to think about it for a while. Tree Hut has a banana, I think it. I think it's an OG one where they discontinued it, so you're gonna have to spend a little coinage if you go that route. Banana muffin, something like that. Something banana muffin, banana muffin-ish. Um, that you can go to layer with this and then if that doesn't work I would suggest now this is empty pay, pay this no mind vanilla you could definitely layer this Bahamas passion fruit and banana flower with something vanilla see the thing about vanilla and maybe you might be tired of hearing about it but there's there's something about vanilla that feels like a warm snuggly hug it just feels like home. A good sugar. You ever had a good sugar cookie? Yeah. That's that's it. That's it. Vanilla cashmere. I, re, I would recommend EOS's vanilla cashmere that you could layer with this. I would recommend, and I've been recommending this a lot, but it works. And that could sound, what I'm about to describe sounds like a really delicious parfait. And I'm pretty sure it will all be edible. Now, mind you, I'm going to bring you back into quick remembrance here. Passion fruit, but pineapple leaves. Now, I don't think the pineapple leaves is edible. So, we'll just go with pineapple. Passion fruit, pineapple, banana flower. Fruits, and I, banana flower, might as well classify that as a fruit. I, I, like I said, I have homework now after this. Now, think of dicing up all of those putting it in a cup that's see-through and then vanilla is is the greek vanilla sugared yogurt parfait drizzle honey on top now you see where i'm going victoria's secret honey lotion definitely will go well with this and see what i've been doing these last couple of months is just picking up stuff left and right left and right and just be layering it and i'm like well it smells good let's put it together See, the thing about it is, and I, I saw, I think it was either on TikTok or Facebook, or somewhere on these internets, about the 
the the fragrance will and it had a floral category an amber category a fruity category i'm i know i'm breaking all the rules and that's all right because that's how you find a good combination that works well in tandem with your body chemistry i'm just grabbing anything i ain't care nothing but i didn't even know there was a such thing as a fragrance wheel that go over compares this fruity category with the floral one i'm breaking all the rules do you hear me honey along with these fruits dice up some banana flower dice up some pineapples dice up dice up some passion fruit drizzle that honey on top vanilla greek yogurt got an excellent parfait healthy too as long as you don't go too far with with, with that honey drizzling it everywhere then you'll be okay Now, I got more videos like this where I go over about fragrance layering. I go over the basics. I go over the, the what I just demonstrated to you all, the note layering, I like to call it. You take a particular note and you expound upon it that way. And on either side, there's going to be a playlist for you all to enjoy that just contains solely fragrance layering if that is your forte. Until next time. Love you.